the gun, sure, mostly. But when I heard about these ticket things, I laid off the gun. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing um, basically like Halloween costumes that you can do just with makeup. Just to get into the Halloween spirit, transform yourself without needing a costume. I already have my face makeup on. If you guys wanna see my everyday routine, I do have a video on my channel. So if you want to go check out my everyday makeup routine, go check out that video. Violet from Willy Wonka. Um, hers is more just like simple and cute. I don't have a wig, but you can always add a wig and you just need like a track suit or anything like that. And I'm just using this little windbreaker because I don't really have a blue or violet track suit. All right, so the first thing that I'm going to be focusing on is the eyes. I'm going to be doing like a light pink kind of shimmery eyeshadow look first. And I'm going to be using two palettes today. I'm going to be using the BH Cosmetics eyes on the 60s and then the BH Cosmetics 88 color palette. Um, I like these palettes because they're super super cheap and um, affordable and also because they just have like the perfect like I don't want to say crazy colors but they just have a full color scheme of any colors you need any shade you need they got it. I am going to start off with the eyes on the 60s palette and I'm going to be using these two light pinks right here. I'm just going to start blending that up on my lid just for a base color and I'm just using a like fluffy crease brush just to blend that all in. Alright, so now I'm going to get into a transition shade for my crease. I'm just going to go into the other palette and just use this brownish color right here. I'm not going in with anything dark. It's definitely going to be a lighter transition color um, because the focus on this tutorial isn't going to be on the eyes, believe it or not. It's going to be on the face. I'm going to take a tighter shadow brush and I'm going to go back in with the pinks and I'm just going to mix all three of these pinks. And I'm using like a tight compact shadow brush and I'm also going to use some rose spray just so we can get that very pigmented kind of look. And I'm going to be focusing this on the inner half of the lid. And this is just kind of creating the bright bubblegum kind of look. More for the outer corner, I'm going to be taking these two purples right here and just kind of blending it on the outer corner into the crease. We're just going to start adding some purples into the eyes. Going to take a little angled um, eyeliner brush and those two pinks right there, I'm going to just drag that underneath my lower lash line. for a pop of color down there. I'm going to stop with the face look right now and move on to the face. I'm going to be having my face kind of like have that bubblegum effect with the purple colors. So I'm just going to take a little rounded fluffy brush and take just like a bunch of these purple colors and just kind of mixing all of them and bringing it down my nose.
just going to be taking my Morphe highlighter and just highlighting some high points. I'm just highlighting my cheekbones like I normally would. I'm gonna highlight my brow bone. The same highlighter. Now I'm just going to curl my eyelashes, put on mascara and put on lashes and just do kind of the finishing touches to this. The actual like eye look itself wasn't really anything big, so. And then I'm just going to go in with my eye lure eyelashes. Now I got the glue on my eyelashes. Ooh, look at my hands, they're so pretty. I'm just gonna let it dry for a little bit. I look so weird now, but I feel like once I have eyelashes on, the whole look's gonna be put together. What? Stop, T. You trying to mess me up? <laughs> you look scary. I know, just wait till I have eyelashes on. It's gonna be cute. Okay. Okay. Good work. Okay, now that my lashes are in, I'm going to go in with some finishing touches, touch up my lower lash line, touch up the blending, all that fun stuff, and then put mascara on my bottom lashes. So now I'm just going to be taking some glitter and putting that in the inner corner of my eyes. Does that hurt? Glitter? Everything. No, but if you it looks get like you're bruising. If you get glitter in your eyes. You kind of look like that girl from Willy Wonka. No, oh, really. Really, thanks. You want me to make you look like this? Yeah. All pretty. Mm -hmm. I'm going to coat my bottom lashes just with the L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara. You guys, you guys know if you've seen my everyday makeup routine. So the next thing I'm going to be doing is just putting on a light pink um, lipstick. This one is Clinique in Matte Beauty. This color is just kind of a like my lips but better color. And then I'm just going to be taking my Buxom lip gloss and just putting it all over the lips. Just like that. And like I said before, I don't have the blonde wig with bangs, but I just have a little windbreaker. This is the final look. It was super easy. This isn't anything like crazy. You don't have to be good at makeup to do this. You're literally putting blue eyeshadow, or blue, purple eyeshadow all over your nose, just kind of blending it up. Some highlighter, pink eyeshadow on your lid, eyelashes, lip gloss, bubble gum. You are good to go. There's an easy Halloween costume. Number one.